I got my buddies here this morning. Got a football. Got the big boy here. Hey, how you, do- how you doing, Pastor? I'm doing pretty good. Who all's up here with us today? Oh, my goodness. Look at those kids. Woo! Look at Whoa, hang on here. Where'd my ball go? I'm going to fall down. Got to put the ball back up here. Yeah. Hi. What's your name? Hi. What's your name? Oh, really? And yours? Isabel? Good to have you all here today. Well, guess what's coming up soon? Easter. And we're going to give this away to some boy or girl that comes on Easter. And how do we know who to give it to? Can we give it to the boy or girl that brings the most children or adults with them? And it has to be new people, not people that are here every Sunday. So you can't just change your seat and sit with somebody. Uh, you got to bring new people. So bring your parents, bring your grandma, bring your grandpa, bring your aunt aunts and uncles and, and neighbors and all that. Bring them up here and fill the house for Jesus. And we're going to give this to the person. They're going to get their choice of the football or... What's your name, Pug? Okay. And um, we're going to give this to whoever has the most. Well, I want to take and uh, look at something with you this morning that I brought. Brought a bag with me. No, it's not to go over my face. Oh, there it is. Thank you. I knew it. Somewhere. Thank you. And I brought some paper. And I brought a pen. Look at that. I remembered it. So proud of myself. All right. Tell me something that's a problem for you. Something that goes wrong during the week. Something that uh, you don't like. Oh, go oh, Gwen. You got to talk louder than that for me. What them? Your neighbor's mean. Your brother hits you. What's wrong with him? He got a knot on his head. Okay, I'll write down. Problem is, brother hits me. That's a big problem. Okay, here, wad that up for me, if you will. Come on, no, wad it up. You know what, wad it up. It's what you want to do to your brother sometime. Wad that up. Wad that up. No, wad it all up into a ball. Come on. No, don't stomp it. You crumple it up. That's it. Crumple it up good. That's good. Good. Now, you feel better? Okay. Okay, who else has got something that's a problem? you got a problem. Tell me what your problem is. Your sister does what? He hits you. I'm beginning to see a problem here. Sister hits me. Okay, Timmy. Your turn. Wad it up. Come on. Come on. What you'd like to do? Come on. Wad it up. Come on. Get it. Get it. Oh, man. Don't you feel better now? Yeah, I know. I don't know. Okay, who else has got a problem? You got a problem? Your mama. Okay, mama. What does mommy do that's a problem? Yeah, mommy and my toys. Okay. Have to clean up those toys. Wad that up. Come on. Get with it. Here, come on. Come on. Get it. Smash it up good. Who else has got a problem? Come on. Anybody else got a problem? You boys don't have any problems. Everything's perfect for you. Everybody's good in your life. No. Never. Everything's perfect. Everything's perfect. Yeah, I got a problem. No one's talking. (laughs) 
Okay, who else got a problem? Whoops. Okay, we got a problem now. What is it? Your mama what? She's mad? Your mama's mean. Let's write that down real quick. Mama is mean. You know this is on video, so you can watch it. Okay, yeah, wad it up. Come on, get with it. Come on, really. Come on, crunch it up. Get, oh, that's it. Hit your frustrations out. Okay, well, here, I'll tell you what. Since y'all didn't talk to you, wad up some more. Come on, wad up some more. Here you go, wad up some. Come on, let's wad them up. Come on, wad them up. Everybody got to wad them up here. Come on, here we go. We got enough wad them ups. Okay, now what I want you to do, what I want you to do is uh, why don't you help me? Why don't you come up here? I want you to take, hold this with both hands. One hand goes there, one hand goes there. Okay, stand right there. Okay, good. Why don't you come up here and help me? Okay, let me have your, your paper. A couple of them. Okay, here you go. I want you to hold this just like this. Okay, hold it up. Real high, you boys are big. Okay. Is that good? Okay, now what I want you to do, y'all fits in to be in the way. You're not going to like sitting there, I'm telling you. <laughs> okay, everybody stand up on the stage. Stand up on the stage. Okay. Now, what I want you to do is uh, I want you to take and uh, start right here, and then everybody come on down, and I want you to go and walk underneath this, and when she walks underneath it, throw them at her. Okay? Go ahead and throw them at her. Y'all try to protect her. Don't drop it. Protect it. Throw your part. Here, come on. Throw them. Throw them at her. Come on. Throw them. Okay, keep going. Keep going. Don't stop. Keep... You're having more fun. Okay. Hold them up there tall. Okay, good. Now, I want you to notice that one of these got saved. Okay, good. That's enough. Now, somebody else come on up and walk under. Here you go. Here's some more. Here, throw them at her. Throw them. Yeah. Protect her. Protect That's it. Good. You're doing good. Oh. Okay, good. Stop. Stop right there. Stop. Good. Okay, you can go back. Here, here. Take you some paper. Here, get you some ammunition. Calm down. <laughs> okay. All right, Timmy. Now I want you to walk under there. Here, give me your... Hey. Oh, well, we don't want to miss any papers. Okay, now, go, go. Come on, bombard him. Come on. Y'all protect him. Protect him. Protect him. <laughs> okay. That's good. Now y'all can go back up there and everybody stand together for me. You can all come up. I want you to know something. Sometimes you get mad at somebody and you just want to throw something at them. You want to get at them. But I want you to know something. God loves them. And this represents God. And God wants to protect you. When somebody's hurting your feelings, God wants to cover you and protect you. You know what you have to do to get protected by God? You have to stay underneath. You have to stay underneath God. So you got to go to God and get underneath the God's umbrella of protection. And what's the way that we can do this? We can come to church. Okay, that's one way to get under God's protection. What's another way? Pray. We can pray. What's something else that we can do? Huh? Believe in God. All of those are ways that we can get protected by God. Isn't that neat? I want you all to remember that this weekend. When somebody hurts your feelings or you want to get mad at them, you can put those balls in here now. Go ahead. Put your trash in here. There you go. You don't want to keep those. You'll have to take those home and use them. All right, good. So what did the blanket represent? God, God's protection. And one more here. All right, good. And what are the balls? That when people are hurting our feelings and God wants to protect you, all you have to do is just learn to look. Let's stand together and form a circle. Can we make a circle? Hold hands. 
Let's hold hands together. Dear God, I thank you for each of these boys and girls, and I pray you bless them. Thank you for your protection that you offer us if we're just coming underneath your blanket of love. In Jesus' name, thank you. You can go to Children's Church now. Thank you.